Hello, my name is Justin Ellis. I'm 19 years old and I'm a sophomore at SUNY Old Westbury. I'm part of the Honors College. I have been for the past two years. And I'm also a member of the National History Honor Society. Um, as well as that, I'm a pretty funny goofball. And I like to have a lot of fun and do silly things. I read lots of books and I also watch TV. I also read on my phone a lot. I love history and that's what really drives me. I also like working with um, disabled people. So I spend a lot of my time doing that. I work in various organizations and groups such as YAI and the Children's Sanger that works with people with disability. And I try to incorporate my love and passion for history with my compassion and empathy towards others to really help uh, create a better world. I was born on August 3rd, 1998. Pretty sure that was a Monday. Luckily, I came into this earth with two other beings that are the exact same age as I am. I have a triplet brother and a triplet sister. I'm the oldest of them and therefore the most wisest. I also suffered a lot of learning disabilities and I had ADHD and I used to do a lot of crazy things. I was very imaginative. In my play as well, I used to play with lots of little army soldiers. I used to like being king and being very controlling. And I think that that ambition um, has steered me in life to always be a leader. And I just always like being on top of everything. Life was interesting. I always had friends that I could depend on. I can always have people that relate to me. But having said that, you know, I always had to share things. Um, and I always, always felt that there was a competition between us. Now, although that happens with a lot of siblings, um, I feel like it was a bit more so in my life because we were so close in age, so our friends, anything we accomplished, anything we did, there was always another person that was doing the same exact thing. Which I think this competition although it seemed very annoying and prevalent when I was growing up, it helped me uh, be a better person and accomplish more than um, per se if I was a single child. I really aspire to be a pillar in the community where I can help change, uh, change the world uh, through educating and through inspiring uh, people of all ages, of all abilities, and of all differences. Um, I feel like through education and understanding of history and really spreading empathy and compassion with everyone um, that we can really be the change that the world needs. And I really believe wholeheartedly that everyone is capable of this. When I was growing up, I experienced a lot of um, hate and um, even discrimination based on my mental abilities. I had a lot of learning disabilities and a lot of problems socializing with other kids and people. So through that experience, it kind of drove me on this path where um, I, I developed this really keen sense of empathy and compassion towards everyone and their abilities. And I, I, it's my mission to really help everyone and especially those people who experience life like I did. I hope that people really um, can take the lessons I've learned because um, it wasn't easy getting to where I am now and I don't take anything for granted. And when people first meet me in the street, they assume I'm very smart, I'm very gifted, um, you know, I have everything and my life's perfect. But rather on the contrary, it's rather difficult and um, it was a battle to get to where I am. And I want to help people and understand that um, although my experience was hard um, and they might be going through hard things, that we all are going through hard things. And if we all work together and have empathy and compassion for one another and a really good community solidarity mindset, we can really get through to each other and change the world one mind at a time. Thank you.